Hello, I'm Shaky. Did you know that you have rights? Better Call Saul is really long, so it's better to just play a Hoi 4 mod that goes through the entire plot of the show. So we'll be playing as the US today. There's some different things in the US though. It's not completely vanilla. Like there's usually not this slippin' Jimmy crisis that has a minus 50% stability modifier. But yep, let's get into this. And huge thanks to the people who made this mod. I'm sure they they were very smart and cute, obviously. So our first goal is going to be to deal with the slippin' Jimmy crisis, but to do it we have to create an intelligence agency. So we'll create the OSS and then we can do the slippin' Jimmy crisis of focus. And we still do of course have the Great Depression, so we still do have to deal with that. Too. Until the OSS is founded though, we'll just not do anything. It's similar to what you do if you want to do the Alf Landon path in vanilla. Okay, and now the OSS has been formed and we will do the Slippin' Jimmy crisis. The OSS has at last uncovered a plot by Slippin' Jimmy, aka James McGill. Okay, so we must find Slippy. The other option locks us out of the mod. So now that we found Jimmy, we have to decide how to get him out of jail. We're kind of playing as him now, I guess. And we have four options. We can give him a president pardon, which is a bad idea, but then he instantly becomes free. He can be represented by his older brother, which takes 70 days but strains his relationship. It's also the historical focus. He can be represented by Howard, which takes longer and improves Jimmy's relationship with Howard, or he can represent himself. We're going to do the represented by Howard one today, even though it's not historical. Also, here's the full focus tree. We'll be going down this one on the left here. And so while we're in court, we will do the end of a crisis focus. The thing about this is technically now the entire Great Depression was caused by this slippin' Jimmy scam thing. So now we're going to solve the Great Depression by really fixing the real problems, which is just this scam. Nothing to do with stocks or anything. It was literally just slipping Jimmy. So we'll have to rebuild the watch industry to save the country. <laughs> um. Yeah, it all makes perfect sense, I promise. We'll also search for the other Slippin' Jimmy associates to further decrease the negative effects of the Slippin' Jimmy crisis. The mod also adds a host of new advisors like James McGill himself, aka Saul Goodman, aka Slippin' Jimmy, um, some other lawyers, and Chuck, and Howard. So we've removed the Slippin' Jimmy crisis, and Jimmy is out of court, so we'll do Into the Wild. And then we have to decide between a career in politics or him becoming an attorney. You can become president with either path, but we'll be doing the attorney one today. We have two paths, a noble pursuit or in any way possible. We'll be doing the in any way possible path, which is the historical path. We also now have these new decisions and our relationship with Chuck, our brother, who's the one we decided not to represent us, will slowly deteriorate over time, so we'll deal with that if possible. We also have other modifiers like our relationship with Howard, legal experience, funds, and then a slip-in modifier because we still are, well, we still kind of are slipping Jimmy, so that may come back in the future and lead us down a dark path. Most of the stuff doesn't really matter though, so all we'll do is party all night, maybe steal from the university too. Yeah, we'll do both of those. So our slip-in is starting to increase. Okay, so now it's the big day. Well, in 35 days, it's the big day. But to become a lawyer, you have to pass the bar exam. So it's time for James McGill to take the bar exam. He doesn't have much experience. He's not very good, but it's, it's okay. He became a lawyer, slipping Jimmy. And now we can try to get a job at HHM, which is our brother's law firm. It's kind of been our dream. So we'll 
do this. And then he denies us the job, but this is the, the historical path, is us trying to get it and then getting denied. So now we've been forced down public defender, and now we have another choice, just like with school, where we could do a noble pursuit or in any way possible. Now we can do outstanding citizen or fudge the rules, and we're going to do the historical path again and fudge the rules. Now we need to, of course, continue to fix the Great Depression by fixing the watch industry. Yeah, our relationship with Chuck is getting pretty bad, but we've also now unlocked some new decisions like meeting with clients and donating to charity. We can finally get some good advisors. Chuck McGill is probably the best, but it's kind of risky getting him, so I'll probably go with Howard Hamblin and then maybe Phoenix, right? Hey, we're now causing some mischief in court. He's become quite the controversial lawyer, at least he's He's cute. Our slipping is now a four out of 10, but not that's not like too bad yet. And we're gonna do some more questionable things now though. We'll also do some secret schemes to increase our slipping modifier. It'll give us some consumer goods benefits for now. Our relationship with Chuck has hit zero and we got the event chicanery. So now Chuck is removed as an advisor. Uh, that's why it's kind of a bad idea to get him because he had his breakdown in court. And our slipping modifier is pretty high though. We have to still get it to 10 before uh, some interesting stuff starts happening. Okay, now we've done one too many tricky things and we're going to get disbarred, meaning we're losing our ability to practice law which is unfortunate, but it is something we have to do to continue with the path. Okay, we've been disbarred, so we've lost all of our decisions for now, but we can do this focus tree now, and we can do some payphone scams and some annoying ads, and things will get better over time. Finally fix the Great Depression by subsidizing timepiece innovation. Great focus. And now we'll do the Goodman plot. This will unlock a decision to take over the United States, but we won't quite use that decision until we've done these other three focuses that will decrease the negative effects of the coup. You know, yeah, a lot has happened in two years. Slip and Jimmy was thrown in prison and now he's about to take over. I'm sure Chuck will be very happy. It's about to make a secret deal with Herbert Hoover. Outside of the US, things are really weird. The Allies invaded Turkey with Greece. Uh, and finally, there he is, the beautiful Saul Goodman, with traits, shadow of Slip and Jimmy, charismatic genius, and expert negotiator. And of course, we're still following the historical events, yes. You know, four focuses, we only have to do one, but we'll probably do multiple. If there's any thought, better think of me for a little support at a time of need. We will want to definitely do better think of me. Yeah, I'll probably do all of them, except the political power. We also finally have enough war support to get off of undisturbed isolationism, so we'll do that soon. So now we've unlocked some world scam decisions. We can have some diplomatic relations with Colombia. We can have a meeting in Panama, some peacekeepers in the Caribbean, and some gifts for Oman and Yemen. Yeah, people are really gonna like us. Now we've started some legal disputes with Mexico. We kind of want to take Baja California, which we will easily take if we want it. They can't can't really stop us. And of course landing in Veracruz, that's just an American specialty. Okay, and Mexico Falls. We'll do the same thing with Cuba and Panama soon too. And we have claims on all of Mexico, so occupying them won't be too terrible. And now we've done the focus called Better Call Saul, and we get the event. You know what it says, of course. So now we have more scams that we can do. The Scotland Ruse, Prague's Lawyer, Defender of India, we'll do Prague's lawyer first. Czechoslovakia received a terrible defense at the Munich conference, so what did they do? They called Saul. Saul came to their aid and gave the Reich a good scare. They agreed to settle outside of court. The Czechs and Slovaks received the best legal defense they could ask for. Better call Saul. The Kingdom of Bohemia is back on the map and fully independent from Germany, I guess. That'll be, um, a keynote in our next focus. Defender of India. India has long been under the thumb of great 
our greed, Britain. So what did they do? They called Saul to get their independence from Britain. However, things didn't go quite as planned. He got their independence from Britain, but not quite complete independence. We kind of um, own that territory over there uh, a little bit. I think, yeah, we can release them though as the American Raj. <laughs> Uh, we'll just keep Pakistan for ourselves. Scotland has long hated being dominated by the English, so what did they do? They called Saul. Saul offered the UK an extended retainer a few months back, but in the fine print, Scotland would have to be offered up as compensation if they failed to pay the bill. With Britain in the red, they have no chance of paying Mr. Goodman. You know, they're a little distracted here. We now have another little puppet state over in Britain now. Our compensation for the retainer. We can now build our base of operations, get some much needed stability. And then there are two routes we can do, Emperor Goodman, where we do our own thing independently, or Breaking Bad, where we join Germany and work with a certain scientist there. Releasing India was a bad idea though, because they immediately went into a civil war. Lord Linlithgow reappeared to be the British puppet figure again. Yeah, yeah, the scam in India didn't go quite well, but you can't win them all, right? Portugal did a good thing with Spain, though. Saul Goodman has found a source of infinite money, Germany. Their plans will obviously fail, but it's time to make a quick buck off the German war machine. Goodman has become close allies with German scientist Werner Heisenberg, who has in turn assisted American researchers. Great. Yeah, great. This Heisenberg guy, good news. Anyways, we've now joined the faction with Germany so we can reform Britain under our Scottish puppet and take Canada for ourselves. And <laughs> Germany needs manpower. No. We're the ones profiting off of you, not the other way around. Anyways, that's the end for now. We've taken North America. We've made Scotland our British puppet state. They don't have the cores, but oh well, I don't care. We'll annex Colombia soon, but that's the end for now. This mod has been released if you want to play it yourself. There are other paths too. You don't have to do the evil Saul Goodman path if you don't want to. But that's it. I'll see you all next time.